Yeah. Just finished banging out an alarm on them. 1999 Ford Expedition V8 model. I put in the 787 Prestige, also known Audio Vox module, with the um, 555U bypass module as well. As you can see, everything is neatly taped up, everything's in order. Everything is just proper. All I gotta do is mount this, mount that somewhere, and the alarm is done. Nice little cute remote. This is the 2010 model. Probably your first time seeing it. Starts up nicely, shuts down nicely as well. Lock, unlock. The double chirp is because the door is open. But that's not what today's video is about. Today's video is about relays. Because I've been getting a lot of emails from you guys about relays and the pinout and the connections and the wiring and etc. etc. So I'm like, yo, why don't I just make a video about relays? Right? So here I am making a video about relays. Alright, first thing first. What the hell is a relay? A relay is something like this. This particular relay has five pins. And you know what's nice about this? This one is labeled. This pin at the bottom is 30, pin 30. The one on the top is 87A. And the one all the way at the top is 87. This one to your left is your 86 pin. This is your 85 pin. Okay. I took the liberty of opening up a relay to show you how it looks inside. Okay. I don't know if you can see it, but this is the actual mechanism of the relay. This is the actual switch switch in action right now this base right here we see the little wire going to pin 30 that's carrying the current and it's going to pin 87A that's on the outer pin where you see that the um this little plate is locked into now when I apply power to the 85 and 86 pin that's the trigger that goes into these coils that sets up a magnetic field. It's going to bring this, the magnetic field is going to bring this plate back. And then the contact is going to go to pin 87, which is this pin. It's going to be these, these two connections right here when power is applied to these two pins. Right now, in a closed loop circuit, where no power is applied to 87 and I mean 85 and 86 you got these two pins these two pins right here that are making contact in a no power situation but in a power situation it's these two pins that's making contact and that completes the circuit to pin 30 and 87 so and this little spring this little retainer spring is just a keep this plate onto pin 87A. This little spring right here. This whole plate right here is connected to this pin. And inside are two little wires from that's I think this is around wrapped around a couple thousand times or a hundred times. I don't know. And it's these two pins right here. Okay. That's that. Now you got You got this thing right here, which we will discuss in video two because I'm only allowed five minutes on the video and I think I already went up to five minutes. So I'll see you back in part two.